guys, Blurbits here and I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be opening this Galay EX box that I bought at Walmart. Yes, you heard it right, I bought it at Walmart, it cost, a, it was in clearance so I, I went ahead and bought it just because why not, it was $3 off, not really worth it and I, ha I still had to play, pay tax so it was around $19 in the end so really just $1 off, well technically it costs more like $22 whenever you buy it as tw like $19.99. But either way, moving on from that, let's go ahead and open this. I'm very excited to open it. I never opened these type of boxes before where they have like um, four um, random packs and then they have this jumbo card and then this regular promo card, which is kind of cool. I, I'm really excited to see how they look, um, you know, like in actual real life in front of me. Let's go ahead and open this box. Today I have scissors, which is going to help me open the things more professionally. Except that I'm, I I want to open these packs a little bit more easier. Let's go ahead and show you guys the back. So this is like the front of the box. Glade, yes, yeah, and there's Glade right there just chilling. You know, with his little side, his little freaking swords. Here's the side view. It just says Glade, yes, yeah, and here's the back side. You guys can pause and read that for yourselves, but I don't really think you... Oh, you can't even read that. Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm not even sure if you can read that. There we go. Let's just go ahead and move on. So there's the box. Sorry for that. Um, awkward noise is the plastic rubbing against other plastic and or just wood actually okay let's go ahead and open it yeah, let's just do it from the side it works like that I really want to open it very carefully I don't want to rip it too much because I like I really like the bots I like the color scheme which is purple dark purple and dark blue green I said blue that's just wow so I don't want to just rip it open like that I want to actually have the bots left over in the end so let's just do just fine. Let's just go ahead and do this. Let's just you know, back do that. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Okay, let's, let's off the top, and there we go. As you can see, I can just pull this out like this, as so. As you can see, nice and professionally. There's the box just left over for some reason. Let's go ahead and move that to the back, just to have it there in the background, which is kind of cool, I guess. Oh, that's a little too far. Uh, that should do. I don't really, I don't really mind too much. And here's the stuff that comes inside the box. That is just beautiful. Okay, let's go ahead and open that stuff because that's what we we're here for in the first place. Okay, I'm so excited. Okay, here's a jumbo card. Let's go ahead and take it out first. Let's start off with that. Why don't we? And put this to the side. Okay. There's the jumbo card, which is pretty dank. I'm not gonna lie. I really like the texture. It's just, it's like a normal card, but like I said, jumbo. And I really like that. It's just a nice card. I really like the card art either way. I like just, I like Glade overall, as a put one. And I like how it just feels so wavy. It already has some white lines on the side, so I don't want to get this any more dented. So let's put this side right here. And I don't have any jumbo screen protectors for that. For, not screen protectors, I'm thinking of a phone any card protectors for that so I won't be able to do, protect that thing somehow um, let's go ahead and get out the where did the promo go the card promo I can't find it oh it's right here sorry right here so you guys can't see that let's get out the packs first you know here's some packs let me just put them to the side for now because the main attraction of this box in the first place is the promo uh, I don't want to mess this up too much Okay, let's go ahead and just push it out, I guess. Hmm. Oh, what? That's weird. Uh. Excuse me, guys. Um, I'm having a little bit of trouble getting it out, so I'll be right back when I can do that. Um, see you guys real soon. Back and I finally got the thing out of there. It wasn't that hard actually. It took me like a second or so. And here it is, nice promo. Um, let me not yeah, prank promo yet. Card. Let me go ahead and focus on that. Looks pretty cool. It has a salt sword because it has swords for hands, and it also has cross slash, which is pretty cool. I like the card. I'm gonna go ahead and protect this because why not? It's like why wouldn't you? Like it's a nice card. And it just looks nice, so there we go. Let's put that in the back. Please stand up. Yeah, don't do this to me. Okay. And this jumbo card, the uh, joint there. And there we go. Now we have like a little nice setup. You know, so so, I guess. I would say 5 out of 10, at the very least. Uh, I don't have any fancy setups. 
plans anyway. And let's see what packs we have. We have four packs. We have a Phantom Force, another Phantom Force, and that's why, and a Hollow Flash Fire. Just kidding. Mm, let's see. We're gonna go ahead and start with Edson Y, and move on to Flash Fire, and then we're gonna go ahead and do Phantom Forces. That's my plan. Let's go ahead and open this Edson Y pack. It's been some time since I opened one of these, obviously, because I haven't bought any packs with them. Not packs, like boxes. Uh, there's still tins and like boxes like this that still have them, but you can't really buy them separately anymore unless you buy them on eBay or uh, I want to open this too badly. At least want to preserve the the wrapping just a bit. So let's go ahead and be careful with what to do here. Oh, spoiler alert! There's a grass energy in this pack. Who knew? Like really, who knew? Like I don't even know you can get that many. Just to preserve this for my personal needs. Okay. Let's go ahead and, oh, there's the code. I won't be showing off the code today, I'm sorry, but I'm starting to preserve them because I actually want to make a video on unboxing these online. Probably won't happen in a while, so let's just move on. Okay, here we go. Dunsparce. Evasoda. Bratzian, or Bratzian. Ener Grass Energy, which is nice. Pikachu. Pansage. Energy Fairy, Fairy Energy. A Venipede in our hollow is a Team Flare Grunt Support. Oh, that's just fine. You know, I already have some of those. Um, and our rare card is a regular rare the barrel. I actually don't have this card, so I'm a little bit I can't really be disappointed because of these cards. I wasn't expecting ES or anything like that. Let's go ahead and um, assort these. That was a nice pack, personally. I had some of those cards obviously because I've opened X and Y before. So not too much there. Just put these aside. Um, I'm not gonna fold it. I'm not gonna put anything in a protector yet because it wasn't that really that that great if I do say so myself. Um, here's Etsy Flash Fire. I can just from feeling it. I don't think there's really that much inside compared to the others, which is kind of strange to say. But let's go ahead and move on and open this Flash Fire. I've never really opened a Flash Fire before. I've always wanted the Mega Charizard Eds card because I just like Charizard Eds in the game. Over Y, because I chose it's over Y, like almost every time. Oh, and this pack wasn't that successful in opening it nicely. Oh well, at least I can keep the front cover nice a bit. Now oh, let's just get that out of there. Oh, spoiler alert, Lit Leo, which is okay. Uh, one, two, three. Uh -huh. Okay, we're starting off with a Roserade. Lissandre. Celio. Lit Leo, hello again. Pidgey. Oh, sorry about that. Esper. Ponyta. Fletchling. A Hollow Shanks, which I already had, which is unfortunate. But either way, our rare is a regular rare Warren. I don't have this card either, so I'm okay with this. And again, I was not expecting anything too rare, which is just fine, personally. I didn't have too many high expectations for this pack. Either way, win-win, there's a promo, and it's a badass. That's all I gotta say. So we have two Phantom Forces. Let's go ahead and open Gengar first. Why not? Am I right? Like, Gengar is just a chill Pokemon. It's so awesome. And I use, like, Mega Gengar overall, which is nice. And then in-game, it's a beast. And the TCG, I don't really, I'm not really sure if it, if it was a good card or a good Mega overall. Go ahead and, oh, sorry about that, I'm doing this wrong. Um, the code, let's put that aside. Here we go, one, two, and three. Sorry, I'm derping out here. Technical derpices. Oh, wait, I forgot. Enchant, enhanced armor? Hammer, enhanced hammer. Swaloon, hand scope, that's strange. Murkrow, Wismer, a Zubat. Swirl it. That was hollow for a second. Lit Leo. Hollow Enhanced Hammer. Hello again. Oh, there you are. Okay, now you're hollow too. Our rare is a regular rare Talon Flame, which is a bit disappointing. Um, again, I don't actually have this card. I'm not sure I'm going to say with every pack, but hopefully we get something else. But I was hoping it was at least going to be a hollow or reverse hollow. I mean, it was just going to be either a hollow or, you know. But that's just fine. Um,. It's okay so far. None of these cards I really have the rare, so I can actually like add them to my collection 
Oh, sorry about that. I almost forgot to open this on camera. Oh, oh, and there goes that piece. Okay, then this was a kind of fail. That's a good little nice opening. Okay, don't get crazy with me here. Oh, well, that's just fine. Let's keep you aside. And code, get over here. One, two, three. Did I do that right? One, two, three. Oh, you did that wrong, John. Uh, Blur Blitz, you did that really wrong. I don't know what I was about to say there. Hmm. Oh well. The Roller Skate, Dimension Valley, a Firo, a Wismer, a La Momola, something like that, Toledo, a Krabby. Oh, spoiler alert. Hell up title and a Water type, which is Crocodile. Oh wow, I love this card. And it's in Hollow too. Amazing. Just amazing. And our rare. Spoiler alert, once more, it's 90 yeah, it's right to like that. Our final card, please be at least hollow or something. It's a uh, regular rare Mighty Gana. Well then, that sucks, because we did not get any um, reverse hollows or anything like that. I don't actually know the proper terms for the cards, the ones that have like hollow here. And then there's hollow down there, so you guys can leave it in the comment section below. What that actually is, because I'm a noob. Not much of a noob, I just never really got into like the correct words vocabulary, which is kind of dumb, because I, I literally make videos on this. But either way, that's what, that was all. Let's have a re recap right really quick. Our first rare was a Babero. Our second rare was a Walren. Our third rare was a Totem Flame. And then our fourth and last rare was a Mediana. Then again, you can't really say this was lost because in the end, we got this badass guard, good guard I was about to say guard war, yeah, it's Galadius, which is a really nice card. And it's in a sleeve and everything. Unfortunately, I'm not going to sleeve anything else because one, the jumbo card is too big. Let's just leave it down on the ground. And everything else was just a regular rare. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.